we are off. There was a uh, boat tournament that let off a few minutes ago. 6.49, lines in at 7. Lines out at 3. And again, we are on Lower Otai, Lower Otay. And as you can see, I think every one of us is powered. It's supposed to be really, really warm today, 70s. Let the season begin. Good one too. Just gotta get him in a boat. Stop taking with the net. Just gotta shake it off. Move on. Shoot. Hundred percent a keeper. There we go. Oh, good fish. Stay hooked, baby. Yeah, nice one. Like 17, probably. Got it. Awesome. It's a nice one there. Perfect tournament fish. On the board, guys. She won't go anywhere. get this right not lose a fish get the picture taken man that's all tangled in my line it's all wrapped up here we found some here for sure all right yeah i'm not quite 17. Sixteen and a half. Maybe get three quarter. All right, guys. There we go. Nice fish. There's no wind. I thought it was spot locked. That should be two. Darn it. Yeah, the other one obviously wasn't that big, but. All right, guys, that's one. Should be two. 
All right, guys, let's get warm back up here. Let's see if we can get another one. So that was two within 50 feet. There's the worm, it's plasma tail by Biospawn. These things are becoming my favorite freaking worm. They just put fish in the boat. At the hookup tackle, recommended those hooks. And they, until last week, they were working extremely well. They were, I was hooking up almost every time I got a bit and getting them in the boat. And then it started jumping fish off. I checked that hook last week. It wasn't the greatest. So I replaced it with this one. But just an oddity, just one of those things, I think. Good deal, guys. That one I did not, Just it just got mushy. Just, I just, it felt heavy. I didn't feel the bite. The other one, I, it bumped it. They both were on this green stuff. Whatever that is, that floating mat is, that's where they were. I think that was a real airplane there. Looked just like the model. No, that is the model. Yeah. It's getting more adventurous. Going out over the water. I think this is probably what we're going to do all day. Brought ten rods with me. And I could see not setting this down. And that weight, I've got the smallest light weight I could possibly get away with here in this. We're sitting in 20 feet of water, so I need a little bit to get it down there, but I think it's, a, it's either an eighth or a sixteenth. Oh, there was another one. Shoot. It didn't feel as big. Barely had a hook in him. <laughs> Somehow my drag got really loose. Come in a disaster. Nice. I was right on him, fighting to catch up to him, and my drag was somehow really, really loose. Nice, guys. This area, I don't think I'm going to leave this area. Fifteen and a half might be able to get three quarter. All right, two. It's ten o'clock. I'm going to pound this area and have to do It's moving up and down this area right here. There's a fighter jet.
There's another one. Awesome. Stay hooked. Ah, oh, he might not keep. It's gonna be close. No, he's not gonna keep. No, it's 11. But you know what? It's a catch 22 fish. He's not a loss. Look at that. Man, he fooled me. He freaking thumped it. I mean, funk. Hammered it. <laughs> Tricked me. Darn it. How many other bites I got? Crappie. I'd come out here with a little jig and just rip those things apart. Yeah, I thought I had number three. Darn it. One of these days, it's going to all come together. That'll keep. Gonna be close, really close. Yeah, that should be twelve. Barely, but it should be twelve. and a half. Awesome. Number three. All right. There we go, guys. Number three. Not making a fool of myself, at least. He stunk. Good deal. There's one. Good one. <laughs> Get off of there. Nice. <laughs> that helps. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> That's what we needed. My big one, I think. There, nope, 16.
very good. Number four, guys. Five. Be big enough, baby. Definitely. in the net yes limit there it is the limit thank you lord had to work for that let's go upgrade cut that 12 out color change And three quarter. There we go, guys. Number five. Beautiful. Now I need to upgrade. is in sitting in ninth let's go cut that 12 out we're in business That's wrap on tournament one. And I'm gonna cut right across. Alright guys, so tournament one in the books. <clears throat> Good, how you doing? Smash him? I did okay. Small limit. Yeah. Did you get on him? <laughs> yeah, I see that. Some guys got them. Uh, we're gonna go big bass first. What was it, Steve? Size? Uh, 19 and a half. 19 and a half. 
150 bucks. Nice. Kevin, the man, shot. Okay. Hey. Sean is grabbing a beer. <laughs> Need to hydrate. Good job, brother. Yeah, the juice. What was the juice on that? That was drop shot on the seven inch. Say it ain't so. Did you win the sunny too? Uh, did you get the sunny side pot or no? I did, yeah. Okay, you already got it. All right. Sixth place. Seventy-eight point seven five inches coming out of retirement due to injury. Tim the man O'Connor. Dang, dude, you're paid, homie. You gotta check for the wall, and it's gonna be stoked, dude. Good job, brother. All right, in fifth place, taking home a hundred bucks. Seventy-nine point two five inches. Juanilo Medina. All right, guys, let's say uh, a wrap on the first SoCal tournament at Ote, Lower Ote. So, really successful day. I'm really happy with how that went. Uh, looks like a 12th place finish, um, provided everything holds the way it is. Right now, they're still 75. So yeah, 70, 75 and a quarter with the big fish of 16 and a half. I could not get rid of that 12 and a half. So that, that jumping that 16 off, or however big that fish was, I had to take a look at it again, but it was at least a 15. Um, so it cost me two to three inches. So if I don't lose that fish, I'm easily in top 10, possibly top five. So it's one of those things, you can't lose fish in tournaments, and that's exactly what I did. But playing with a net I should have just hauled that fish to the boat got him in the boat but lesson learned so that's one in the books um, shout out to Steve Norby um, he got on him pretty good He's top 10 finish actually good job all guys really good good guys um, excited to hit uh, hit up San Vicente again that lake is kind of my nemesis so we'll see how that goes but number one in the books and San Vicente is next in a month. But what well, I think I'm going to fish this lake some more before I get moving on to there. I need to practice for um, Guntersville. And this lake is basically the closest thing I have to Guntersville. So I'm going to continue to fish here and hopefully uh, figure more and more out. Learn how to fish chatterbait better. And obviously I'm getting better with the drop shot. And I need to work on my Senko fishing, my my swim swim jig and chatter bit. Take the day and drive. I'm gonna drive out this back way and show you some of that footage. But good day. Thank you for joining us. I really appreciate it. I think we got a total of a total of six fish in the boat. With a crappie in there too. And a crappie on a drop shot on a four inch worm. Really, really odd. Um, second time that's happened in two weeks. And then, yeah, dropping two fish. I tried to boat flip a 12-incher, which ended up not really hurting me unless it was a 13, but I don't think it was. So, All right, guys, so stay tuned. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget, like, subscribe, and we will probably see you back here next weekend. Um, all right, guys, thanks so much. We'll see you soon.